The Su-57 fighter is a Russian-made fifth-generation stealth fighter. Previously known as the PAK-FA or Perspectivny Aviacionny Complex Funtovoy Aviatsii, it was first announced in 2002. It was designed to replace other fighters, such as the Su-27 and MiG-29 fighters in the Russian Air Force's military fleet. The Su-57 fighter is a stealth fighter designed to produce a low radar cross-section or RCS, so it will be very difficult to detect by enemy radar. This fighter is also equipped with advanced control and navigation technology or systems, as well as weapon systems that can be used to destroy targets in the air or on the ground. The Su-57 fighter uses Saturnese Delhi 30 turbofan engines, which provide thrust and maximum speed of up to Mach 2 and a range of up to 3,500 km per hour. It is also equipped with advanced avionics, including Bielka's ESA N036 radar and weapon launch technology system. The Su-57 fighter has undergone a series of trials and was delivered for use by the Russian Air Force military fleet in 2020. It is expected to become Russia's flagship fighter in the next few years, and can compete with the United States fifth-generation fighters, such as the F-35 and F-22. Here are some of the advanced technologies or features of the Su-57 fighter jet. 1. Stealth design. The Su-57 fighter is designed with shapes and materials that minimize the appearance of stealth radar, making it difficult to be detected by enemy radar. 2. Integrated weapon system. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with a variety of weapons, including air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-ground missiles, and cannon guns. All these weapons have technology that can be controlled through an integrated weapon system, which allows the pilot to select, lock, and launch weapons effectively. 3. AESA radar. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with an AESA or active electronically scanned array radar, called N036 by Elka. This radar is capable of detecting targets in the air and on the ground over long distances, as well as identifying targets that are difficult to detect by enemy radars. 4. Integrated Electronic System The Su-57 fighter is equipped with an integrated electronic system that combines avionics, navigation systems, and control systems. This technology allows the pilot to control the aircraft effectively and makes it easier to avoid enemy attacks. 5. Saturn is Delhi 30 turbofan engine The Su-57 fighter is equipped with a Saturn is Delhi 30 turbofan engine, which provides a maximum speed of up to Mach 2 and a range of up to 3,500 km. The engine is also equipped with an advanced digital control system and is fuel efficient. 6. Advanced pilot cabin The Su-57 fighter is equipped with an advanced pilot cabin, including an electro-optical seat designed to enhance pilot safety in emergency situations. 7. Super maneuverable capability. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with technology that allows the aircraft to perform extremely difficult maneuvers, including Pugachev's Cobra technique, which allows the aircraft to make sudden turns. This technology makes the Su-57 extremely difficult for enemy aircraft to pursue and allows it to strike targets more effectively. 8. Autonomous aircraft mode. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with an autonomous aircraft mode that allows the aircraft to fly and act autonomously without pilot intervention. This mode allows the pilot to focus on more important tasks, such as battlefield surveillance or tactical planning. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with a wide range of weapons that can be selected and launched through an integrated weapon technology system. Here are some of the weapons used by the Su-57 fighter. 1. Air-to-air -air missiles. The Su-57 fighter is equipped with a wide range of air-to-air -air missiles, including the R-73 short-range missile and the R-77M long-range missile. These missiles are designed to track and destroy fast-moving aerial targets. 2. Air-to-ground missiles, Su-57 fighters are also equipped with air-to-ground missiles such as the KH-59 Mk-2 and KH-58 Ushake. These missiles are designed to destroy ground targets such as military bases, bridges, and infrastructure facilities. 3. 
Cannon weapons, SU-57 fighters are equipped with 30mm internal cannon weapons, which are designed to fire high-velocity fire shells to destroy close air and ground targets. 4. Bombs. The SU-57 fighter can carry various types of bombs, including the FAB-500 freefall bomb and the KAB-500 guided bomb. These bombs are designed to inflict significant damage on ground targets such as buildings, roads, and vehicles. 5. Nuclear weapons. SU-57 fighters can also carry nuclear weapons, including nuclear bombs and nuclear ballistic missiles. All the weapons are controlled through an integrated weapon system, which allows the pilot to select and launch weapons effectively. In addition, SU-57 fighters are also equipped with advanced avionics systems that allow pilots to track targets with high accuracy and select the most appropriate weapon to launch an attack. Like any other fighter aircraft, the Su-57 fighter also has weaknesses that need to be considered. Some of the weaknesses of the Su-57 fighter are, 1. Expensive. The Su-57 is an expensive fighter, with very high development and production costs. This can make it difficult for many countries to acquire, 2. Production issues. Production of the Su-57 fighter has experienced some technical and logistical problems, which slowed down production and caused delays in delivery. 3. Engine problems. The Su-57 fighter's engine experienced several problems during development, including oil leaks and problems with the turbine. This caused some delays in development and testing. 4. Limited stealth performance. Although the Su-57 fighter is designed to be a stealth fighter, some experts argue that its stealth performance is still limited. This is due to several factors, including the relatively large size and shape of the fuselage and the use of non-stealth materials such as the underside of the aircraft. 5. Weapons production limitations. The Su-57 fighter currently suffers from limitations in the production of advanced weapons that can be launched from the aircraft such as air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles. Despite this, many experts believe that the Su-57 fighter is still an advanced and powerful fighter that can make a significant contribution to the defense capabilities of the countries that use it. The price of an Su-57 fighter aircraft can vary depending on several factors such as the country of purchase, the number of orders, and the purchase contract sign. However, in general, the estimated cost of a single Su-57 fighter aircraft ranges from 100 to 120 million US dollars. However, it is important to note that this price is still subject to change due to ongoing development, production, and testing costs. In addition, the operational and maintenance costs of the aircraft may also increase the total cost of ownership of the Su-57 fighter in the future. In comparison, other fighter aircraft such as the F-35 Lightning II and Chengdu J-20 are also highly priced, with per unit production costs running into billions of US dollars. Therefore, the relatively affordable price of the Su-57 compared to other fighters makes it an attractive option for countries looking to strengthen their defense capabilities with advanced technology.